Yes, what you are looking at is not a figment of your imagination. I am officially on Hong Island. And I am super duper 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 excited to be here. There's a nature trail that will take you all the way to the very, very top of this island. I took pictures of the people at the top earlier. Um, in case you guys don't know me, I'm a little bit out of shape. <laughs> that's probably not gonna happen. Actually, that's not gonna happen. Let me just go ahead and dispel any rumors that there may be. And now uh, we will take a walk down here towards the beach because I'm sure you guys don't want to see my pretty face. You want to see what's out here. And this is just straight up beauty. Just straight up beauty. That's all I can say. That's where we docked at. That's where we came in from. And it's just a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful place. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful place. I'm very excited to be here. And I'm also very excited not to go swimming in the water. Why do I not want to go swimming in the water? I don't know, but it would probably cool me off. I am extraordinarily hot and that's okay. Is this not some true beauty though, guys? I mean, like really, this has got to be probably some of the most beautiful stuff I've ever seen in my life. And I'm super duper happy to get to share it with all you guys. I really, really am. Here is some more signage in case you are ever curious about coming to Hong Island. It's a national park. You have to pay 300 baht um, to get on the island. And that's after you paid your you know, boat and whatever company hooked you up with the tickets and that kind of thing. Obviously there's a nice lagoon down here, a little beach. Um, it's pretty cool, man. Pretty cool. We'll go back walking through the shade later, but for right now, I wanted you to see the, where they close the opening off there. And just the general swimming in the lagoon. I guess you would call that a lagoon. I'm gonna call it a lagoon. All right, it's time for me to take some Instagram photos and some pictures. See you shortly. I just found a little something else I would like for you guys to see. And that is a sign telling you where to go um, here on Hong Island. So ranger station, swimming area, restroom. There's a viewpoint, 160 meters, but I bet it's all uphill. And this is kind of what it looks like uh, in the interior. There's a restaurant here, which appears to be closed and a visitor center. And then of course we have a nice uh, lifeguard tower up here. And people are just swimming away in the beach, swimming away in the beach. I thought about dipping in just to cool myself off, but I don't wanna have to dry out in salt water. That's a painful experience. Okay guys, I have toured and done just about everything you can do here on Hong Island. I am headed back for the beach so I can at least walk you out on some sand here while we have the opportunity. Um, it is blazingly hot. I mean blazingly hot. It rained last night and I guess the humid this morning. It's about 12.30 now but I guess the humidity just came out in full force because it was uh whew, it was hot 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 when I got here and the tide has come so far in that I may have to walk around just a little bit here and not to get sprayed by ocean water in fact I think I'm gonna have to I don't know I just don't know let's see There we go. Okay, so I stepped over the tree that I need to step over. And we are headed back towards the 
rocks right now. I mean rocks. <laughs> well, we are, are headed towards the big rocks, but we're also headed back towards the boat. And I'm pretty excited about that. I gotta be honest with you. I'm ready for the next island. And uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed this tour of Hong Island. Right there it is. I will catch you on the next one. Whatever you do today, be sure to do more life.